Hey guys, Ashwin here, and welcome back to my channel. Uh, I'm going to do a little backstory before we get to the important news. So, I started playing Coracraft back in 2013 or 2014. I remember getting the crack launcher from my friend from primary school at the end of primary school, like at the end of year 6 when I was moving into high school. I got it from his USB or something, and it was a crack launcher. And I started playing single player and my little brother had just begun playing multiplayer and he was freaking addicted to this one server named Craft World. And I think I started playing on the server and I made a base on there. And that base got raided. And someone placed a sign on that base saying come join this awesome server. And that server was Corecraft. So I joined and I started playing for a little bit. I started like <laughs> I wasn't the best factions player. I made wooden bases in the sky. It got raided, burnt down most of the time, but I kept on doing it. And I had a faction which was open to everyone to join, so it was like there was more than twenty people in it. It was pretty much chaos at the point. And and after a little bit I think I bought a premium account and then I left Corecraft for a bit. I went to play on other servers. I found this server named what was it? Can't even remember the server's name. But the owner was really cool. I became a server manager on there. And then I started becoming very bored of it and that server actually got closed down because the owner wasn't getting money. <laughs> wasn't getting much donations and he couldn't continue supporting the server so I joined Corecraft and as soon as I joined I donated for legend rank and I started playing as a normal member and I had fun on there and after a little bit uh, I'm trying to recall all this but after a little bit I remember that a boost king decided to add me into a skype group and they decided to trial me as a trial mod on the normal PvP factions back in the day, which was just normal classic factions. So yeah, and I think I was good. And it, at the end, I replaced the Fluffy Goose as trainee on PvP factions. And since then, I slowly got promoted up. I think I became head admin. Let me check. I became head admin around 19th of May 2015 and became owner of around I think like 20th of February 2016 so around like one year later after becoming staff and now that OP Factions is up and running I want to say that I'm actually going to be leaving Cogra it's been so much fun I've met so many people and I would like to thank the owners for giving me this great opportunity to work on an amazing community with an amazing community which was already established for me. Uh, they gave me so much freedom and I decided to make my own little game modes like Practice and SE Faction. I had most fun working on SE Faction because I always wanted to have a custom enchanted server and I remember starting with like basic plugins and everything and it turned out to be an awesome server and it has its own little fan own little community which is really awesome and redstone pvp i don't know what happened to that but hopefully it gets added back because that was really fun op factions will always be the most popular on the server it is really fun and i still enjoy the server so i'm most likely going to be playing as a member i do have an ultimate rank so you guys might see me on here, but I'm going to be starting my own little projects, so stay tuned for them. And when I get a better PC, I'll start uploading CSGO videos, because I really like CSGO now. Uh, I've met lots of people through it, and it's really fun. I've, like, I think I like it more than Minecraft at this point. So yeah guys, that's about it. This was one take. I might have stumbled it quite a few times. I'm not going to edit this because this is going to be natural, 100% natural, no makeup. <laughs> Alright guys, see ya.